Welcome to The Roar. I'm Cameron Anderson. Starting off, we have today's announcements. Yearbooks are on sale for $65. Go to yearbookordercenter.com and enter the code 3182. For updates, follow at LHS the Line on Twitter. Main Online, Main Line Online has a bunch of cool school news. If you don't like the website, then you can use Twitter. Hit them with a follow at LHS Mainline. Maybe you don't like Twitter, then you can also go to at Humans of Lansing High on Instagram. Do you like ice cream? Well, happy birthday, Kansas. In honor of Kansas' 155th birthday, the cafeteria will be serving ice cream on Friday. Also this Friday, the University of St. Mary will be visiting. If you are interested, sign up in the guidance counselor's office the day before. Children's Mercy Park, formerly Sporting Park, is holding a job fair tomorrow for part-time event staff. Most positions are 18 plus. However, they may be inclined to take a high school student if they are at least 16. The job fair will be at Children's Mercy Park, One Sporting Way. If you need even more information, email Stephen Howell at showell at sportingkc.com or call 913-912-7511. Boys basketball goes to Lawrence today and girls basketball travels to face Spring Hill. Good luck, guys. Here's what happened at yesterday's bowling competition. Only was it nice for the Lansing bowling teams to return home to Crown Lanes on Monday, but they added a cherry on top by bringing their A games. The Lion Girls knocked over the competition in a quad competition, pacing action with the best event, 2,198 points, easily outdistancing Kansas City Turner, Blue Valley Northwest, and Blue Valley West. Lansing boys edged past Turner, 2,435 to 2,307. The highest points the girls scored were 660. Dustin Reynolds continues a strong season with a score of 682 to easily win the individual race by 71 pins. Good job, guys. If you want to be just as stressed out as I am, you could try taking broadcasting. Let's learn more with Marissa, Madison, and Camille. I feel like broadcasting every day is a really good idea. It's going to be a lot of work, but I'm sure we can do it. I joined broadcasting because I enjoy making and editing videos, and I'm in theater, so it's kind of an outlet to use my theatrical skills. I think a daily show would be a good idea because if you're looking into going into broadcasting later in your life, it's a good experience. Boy, broadcasting is fun. Well, that's all we have for today. Thanks for watching.